and welcome back guys we're gonna go ahead and play some more atomic heart uh, make sure you hit the like button make sure to subscribe button we're gonna try to finish this general area before we get moved on to another area uh, before I probably go to sleep for a little bit I was questioning should I go to sleep now or should I push out another piece of content I'm like you know what let's play a little longer <laughs> anyways let's get into playing some more atomic heart I made my inventory larger, by the way, for those that are being caught up. Look at that extra space. Before I only had all this, I gave myself one, eight, nine, ten slots. Holy shit. All right, yeah, you're looking kind of glued to the wall there. You all right? Doesn't, you don't look all right. Hey, Charlie, why couldn't they just put regular, more reliable locks everywhere? Like with codes and shit? I suspect it's because if they had, anyone who hacked the code would be able to open the locks without authorization. Yeah, but now anyone who solves the puzzles can get through. In other words, pretty much anybody. Your head. special neuro connectors from Sechenov's team look like? The special neuro connectors have the Greek letter Gamma on them, and are shaped like bracelets. They are worn on the right arm. Gamma? What happened to Beta? Or are those the fake connectors you told me about? The fake connectors do in fact have the letter Beta on them, but the Beta connectors were real at first. Uh, I don't get it. The first experimental prototypes of the neuro connectors with discretionary authority were called Beta connectors. There were only two of them, and Dr. Sechenov designed them to look like rings. So, what happened to them? After the necessary experiments were complete, Dr. Sechenov removed these rings from the list of special neural connectors. Enhanced gamma models, shaped like bracelets, were then made for the scientists, one for each member of his team. Okay, there are only seven of those gamma connectors? For Vavilov, Korolyov, Kurchatov, Lebedev, Pavlov, Filomonenko, and Chelome? Indeed. Seems like
I see something. Trying to figure out how to do this. Oh, I'm getting a sense maybe hey doesn't feel very good now does it If I was falling asleep, I'm definitely awake now. <laughs> huh. Oh, thank God I don't have to go for that crap again. Help, help, I get it to the wall.
not that one. It might be this one. Guessing is I have to get under the snow. <laughs> Hopefully that's what I'm supposed to be doing. One of those where I have to climb up stuff basically to get up. I have no idea. Pipe usually means I can climb it. I don't understand.
stuck on something. Well, this is unique. A little inception, anyone? Jesus. Alright, so if I went this way, where would I go next? I see a little wheel thing, and I'm guessing it's gonna make me press that wheel thing, but the real question of why and how. Hmm. <sighs> I'm guessing it's going to make me turn this wheel. That. You have reached the facility's service rooms, Major. One of my dear Claire's legs is most certainly there. Yeah, the truth is out there, right? I've never seen bots like these before. This robot is very dangerous in melee combat. <laughs> oh, so that's why I'm getting my ass kicked. Yeah, I'll say. Say very dangerous. Ooh. That was fucking scary. How much damage that thing did. Holy crap. I had to check. Ooh. Charles, I've never seen Dr. Sechenov wearing a bracelet before. Does his Alpha Connector look different? Indeed it does. His device is unique, and its shape and location are one of Dr. Sechenov's deepest secrets. So his Alpha Connector must be really well guarded. Who's watching it, Argentum? Entrusting humans with the Connector would be far too risky. It's guarded by Dr. Sechenov's personal bodyguards. You mean the ballerina twins? The way they move. They're so graceful and elegant. Hey, and they kind of remind me of something. Is that so? What exactly, Comrade Major? I don't know. Something... something good. Ah, open up already. We're running out of time here.
Here's your leg, do yourself a pair thing. <laughs> cool tech. Granted. the desired procedure. Major weapon. Granted. Going through a lot. That's too much. I think about making that at some point. the desired procedure.
I was going to end it, but we're, we're not 50 minutes, so let's go ahead to 50 minutes here. New scanning cycle. Module, limb, arm, right, found. Location, Vavilov floor. Transmission obstructed. Really Data incomplete. <sighs> Badly. What's the holdup? Why can't we locate the module this time? I'm afraid I can't help you. There's some kind of interference on this floor. Possible sources of interference include electromagnetic shielding or the presence of a large, elongated object. A large, elongated object? That sounds odd. Wow, there's a big honking thing in here, and lots of little fuckers. to do with this.
What is this, a kid's game? That is a puzzle kit. Nice. What's it for? I believe it activates some sort of process. I don't understand it. I think I'm trying, I'm person. Wait. I'm just gonna sit here and do nothing, see what happens. I guess I just have to sit here and watch it, I'm guessing. Get it. I don't get it.
I see what I gotta do, though. Oh my gosh, I hate, I, I dislike this so much. Ever play that game called Slither? That's basically what this is. Or uh, the more points you get, the longer your snake becomes. That's pretty much what this is. The only thing is, it's more you get of these fast the worm goes. faster with more times you fail. That's actually really hard, by the way. The more you fail, the faster it goes, by the way. Go in the middle. Oh shit, speed 
な。Charles, is that the process I just activated? Run! Where? Hey, hey! What the hell are you doing? Damn it! Ooh, okay. I'm getting to the same point because that you was metal really, son of a bitch. really aggravating. You scared the ever-living fuck out of me. That was close. Well, whatever. I got the arm. This looks like the right one. Let's go find the rest. There we go. So glad I got that upgrade. Charles, why did the boss take the real beta connectors out of commission? Were they defective? Not entirely. Dr. Sechenov wasn't convinced that there was any need for discretionary authority within Collective. So the boss wanted total equality, but Molotov's schemes changed his mind? Perhaps so, Comrade Major. What do you mean, perhaps? Dr. Sechenov wanted equality for... There can be no question of that, but consider this. The Alpha Connector existed from the very beginning. Maybe the boss wasn't planning to use the Alpha Connector's power. He just needed it to launch Collective. That's possible, right? Anything is possible. Hmm. Authorization. Major Nichayev. Do, 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 do.
So, what will it be, Major? Weapons or a... I was not expecting that at all. The desired procedure. Okay, first arm's good. Scanning cycle. Module. Limb. Arm. Left. Found. Location. Tableau floor. Uh, could you be a little more specific? <laughs> this is terrible. It plunged into something warm and sticky. Oh my. It is red polymer. Disgusting. What does this even mean? I am sorry, dear comrade. This is the only data I have available. I hope I managed to help you. You sure did. So I don't have to deal with this later. I'm gonna chop these bodies in half so they cannot be turned into zombies. We really like not to have to deal with that shit. And then YouTube's gonna complain at me. Hey, stop that! You're chopping people in half! And you're not allowed to do that! I know. Well, I hate to say it. I am not dealing with fucking plants and having bodies of dead people here, like, it's just not gonna happen. <laughs> Alright. Lights out! 
You asked for it. Hold this for me, would ya? robots there. One, two, three, four, five. I don't want to go in there. Six. I really don't want to go in there now. Seven. So, what will it be, Major? Weapons or abilities? It's like, hey, you're gonna need this. I'm like, I don't want to go in there. Sure, I have to go in there. Wow, a lock. <laughs> Didn't see that coming. <laughs> what is that? Oh God, no one of these. All right, so you need to be here. thinking all right I got some funny feeling all right buddy chopping you guys in half here so I don't have to worry Make about yourself this. comfortable would you like to hear about whales no no stop please stop Get any chances. Damn, there are dead people all the damn place. Cut them right in half so there's no reanimation. That's what I'm doing. I'm just gonna cut them in half. I know that sounds really fucking disgusting and wrong, but uh, in order to prevent them from Coming back. Alrighty. I don't know why we need to see that now. What's that crap in the canisters? Be careful! a specimen called Pliush, or Ivy. It is extremely dangerous. Yeah, I've seen this crap before. And of course, the ripped up. Mir too. Why could it just be lying in a corner somewhere? Holy shit. Where are you? Get 
Well, that explains all the save points. <laughs> Alright, I think I'm going to be in here in a minute, after I collect that stuff again. Um, first thing I want to do is set the fire right up. Let's go see what this thing's resistant to. What's that crap in the canisters? Be careful! That is a specimen called Pliush, or Ivy. It is extremely dangerous. Yeah, I've seen this crap before. And of course, the ripped off arm is in there too. Why could it just be lying in a corner uh... somewhere? Well, I already know I'm dead, so. And it. Is I'm gonna look back at the recording to see what its damage is, and then I can utilize what I need to do to kill it. <laughs> Anyways, make sure you hit that like button, make sure you subscribe button. I'm gonna go to sleep. When I go to upload this video tomorrow, uh, they'll be counting for like last night, but you get the idea. Anyways, make sure you hit the like button, make sure you subscribe button. I'll see you guys in the next video.